I've been requested to make a video showing you how to connect a silicon graphics machine to the internet. So today I'm going to show you how to connect a silicon graphics machine to the internet making use of a static IP address. Two things to take note of before I get started. Firstly this is IREC 6.5 and the machine is connected to the internet via a router. So I'm going to get things started by quickly logging in. This machine isn't currently connected to the internet so I'm going to quickly attempt to run Firefox to show this. Okay, so there it says address not found, so I'm not currently connected. So what I'm going to do is go into system, system manager, networking and connectivity. I'm going to select it up and start networking. I'm using the standard network port on the machine. The machine's name is astra.homerouter.cpe. This is the machine's IP address. And I've also checked the box which selects use default netmask. Okay, I'm going to select to restart the system. And there the machine restarts. Okay, I'm going to try and run Firefox 3 again. Okay, so that failed to connect again. What I'm going to do now is take you through a few files that need to be checked in order to set this connection up correctly. So I'm going to start off by going into Unix root. From there into etc. I'm firstly going to check the system ID file. Okay, the system's name is correctly listed. And from there I'm going to go and check the hosts file. And there again, the system's IP address is correctly listed as well as the system's name. From there I'm going to check resolve.conf. And here you've got the domain name which is homerouter.cpe and the IP address listed is the router's IP address. Next I'm going to go into the config folder and check static root options. Okay, so this is the entry that needs to be entered in order to make it work. It's got a hash sign in front of it for now just to disable the line. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete the hashtag and then from there I'll go through it. The IP address shown is the router's IP address. So it's add minus net default and then the router's IP address. I'm going to save the file. And then select to restart the system. Okay, so I'm now going to log in for hopefully the last time. And I'm going to try and start up Firefox 3 again. And there Google comes up. So I'm now successfully connected to the internet making use of a static IP address. This concludes my video showing you how to connect a silicon graphics machine to the internet making use of a static IP address. I hope you enjoyed the video and found it to be informative. Thanks very much for watching.